So these two paintings I did last night uh, at a uh, live painting workshop in uh, Plano, Texas. Uh, Plano is near Dallas, so uh, so this painting took me about an hour uh, because I know like the, my main the, the the big painting that I normally I do on a much bigger canvas it takes me about two hours. But since it's a three hour workshop, I thought normally I always. Um, you know, do another smaller painting. So this time I started the smaller painting first. So I, I was sitting like fairly uh, up front because I tried to do a portrait, like a close up. So I tried to get as close as I can. So, uh, you know, it turned out okay. You know, actually I haven't done a, a realistic painting for some time now because, you know, I just tried to, you know, try to do other things in the past few months. Um, for me, you know, but in a, this painting is just as realistic as it gets uh, because there's a lot of edge problems that I could work on and there's other things uh, but overall it, it turned out okay you know it's not the best but um, I did like how the color turned out uh, you know I wish I could take care of the, uh, the edge a little better but yep you know so this is the, the my first painting uh, the second painting, I was, uh, you know, I was stepping way back. I was behind everybody, so I, I was able to see the, the entire figure. Uh, so the second painting took me about uh, an hour and a half, uh, and uh, it was really good. You know, I, I really satisfied how the, the painting came out. Um, uh, for some reason, I just love how the, the color of the, the model and the compositions and also everything on him was just really unique and the, the shapes and colors um, you know sometimes when you paint you know you don't always get the, the best execution and you don't always perform well but in this case I think I did a fairly good job and especially in the beginning it's just a lot of energy in the in my figure and you know I, I try to as much as I would like to continue defining certain shapes but at the same time I try to keep that energy within the painting and that's the hardest thing you know you try to you know take your painting to more finish but at the same time you want to keep it lively you know as lively as possible so obviously I try to push colors and you know um, I try to uh, give contrast not only just you know value color and shapes but also the, the brush strokes you know like the busy areas versus fairly calm and um, you know to be honest next painting I'm gonna do if it's gonna be a fairly dark background I'm gonna just fill in the darks because I feel like the background is it's a little busy or a little too busy but overall it's okay and uh, you know I kind of like it and thanks for watching and uh, till next time.